All right. First and foremost, I want to start off by saying, Barakatheya Hawa, Barakatheya Hawa Shai, Barakatheya Hawa, Barakatheya Hawa Shai, Barakatheya Hawa, Barakatheya Hawa Shai, Call Hala Yahawa, Bashem Yahawa Shai, Bashem Raka Kwadash. Double honor to the apostles of GMS who rule well and who taught me this truth. And uh, Shalom to you, sincere Akiam, out there listening, learning, and pushing this truth. And uh, Shalom to the few sincere Akwath that are out there listening and learning as well. With that being said, I'm going to jump straight into this video. I don't want to write this out. It'll be edifying. As usual, I'm going to go into the Raka Kwadash. And it's going to be real quick. Um, I'm not going to say too much. I'm not even going to read it because you can see what it says on the screen. Uh, it's breaking news uh, from Sky News. Uh, bre breaking news coming out of Austria. And um, we already know we already knew this was coming down the line. We've been uh, reporting on it. Hey, we definitely are in these times. I'm not going to speak too much because um, you, any little thing you say, they'll strike the video, man. So I'm just going to read a scripture straight to the point, and I'm going to play the video, and I'm going to close out. Hey, but like I always say, hey, keep pushing. We're close. Keep your eyes on the prize. Hey, hey repent, man. The doors of mercy are drastically closing. All hell is about to break loose, you know. All hell is about to break loose, all right. This is the quiet before the storm. You know, I keep saying it over and over. 2021 is the year of hastening the coming of our Lord. Yahweh Ba Shem Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. And uh, that was coined by our elder, Elder Apostle Tahar. And uh, each year has a, has a particular vibration. So we're, we're at the end of 2021. So 2022 is going to be a completely different vibration on the earth. All right. Lord's will, hey, we be, we, we, we'll be up out of here, man. Our, our redemption is nigh. Keep pushing, man. Keep pushing. Keep fighting. You know, we're close. We're close. Second Ezra 8 and 50. For many great miseries, we're at the door. We're in these times, man. Jacob's trouble. Daniel 12 and 1. A time late never before. Read Jeremiah chapter 30. Jacob's trouble is right around the corner. The hour of temptation. It's right around the corner. You know, Revelation 12 and 12. Second Ezra 8 and 50. For many Many, many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time, we're in the latter time, shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride and pride goeth before destruction. But you can't say you haven't been warned. You, you can't say you didn't hear this word. This gospel has been, this gospel has been preached to the four corners of the earth. And what did the Lord say? Then the end shall come. You know, the elder apostle Tahar Ben said he, he thought the elect were sealed already. You know, I have, I have, I'm starting to feel the same sentiment, man. All hell is about to break loose. This word has gone out. The Lord has magnified this truth. There's no excuse. There's no excuse. Repent. Austria is to become the first country in Europe to make COVID-19 vaccines mandatory by law. And Austria is to become the first country in Europe to make COVID-19 vaccines mandatory by law. Austria is to become the first country in Europe to make COVID-19 vaccines mandatory by law. And the country has announced a full national lockdown from Monday. The first country in Europe to make COVID-19 vaccines mandatory by law. And the country has announced a full national lockdown from Monday. The first country in Europe to make COVID-19 vaccines mandatory by law. And the country has announced a full national lockdown from Monday. Austria's Chancellor Alexander Schallenberg said the lockdown would run for a maximum of 20 days. Yesterday, the country recorded more than 15,000 new cases of the virus, setting a new record high for daily positive tests. This comes as a fourth wave of the virus is beginning to take hold in Europe. Austria had previously imposed restrictions on the country's unvaccinated population, but will now go into a full national lockdown. Yesterday, the German Chancellor Angela Merkel announced lockdown restrictions for those who haven't received an injection in areas struggling with a high infection rate and limited hospital capacity. Chancellor Angela Merkel announced lockdown for the country's unvaccinated population, but will now go into a full national lockdown. 
Yesterday, the German Chancellor, Angela Merkel, announced lockdown restrictions for those who haven't received an injection in areas struggling with a high infection rate and limited hospital capacity. Meanwhile, here in the United Kingdom, the government has added proof of a third vaccination, so-called booster jab, to the NHS app, uh, as a growing number of countries make it a requirement for travel.